In Piatt County, a group of middle school students have a lot to celebrate. What started as a science project has recently turned into something much bigger. WCI3's Amanda Brennan has the story. The Met 8th graders are exploring the world of STEM in a whole new way, building their own wind turbines. This ties into what they do in um, science with um, energy and motion. Um, and in math, we talk a lot about angles this time of year. Um, so I decided, well, this would be a good way to see those things in action. The students got to work. The only part that was really like up to us was the blades. So we had to get, we had to figure out the design of the blade and then the pitch of the blade. After experimenting in the classroom, they took their turbines on the road to the Kid Wind Renewable Energy Challenge in Normal. We spent um, about half of our time there working on tunnel testing, changing angles. We hooked um, a generator up to these two cords that would see how many joules the windmill generates. On the first go around, we only generated about four joules because our the pitch of our blades was too steep, but then he gave us some advice to make them a bit flatter so that they'd catch more wind. In the end, his team got second place, other classmates first. They're walking away with lots of new knowledge. I learned that one um, windmill can power like up to 300 homes, so about like the size of our town. And a very proud teacher who always has their back. So it's been neat to see them kind of work within their groups and work with each other to learn. Um, and to teach each other. Reporting in Bement, Amanda Brennan, WCIA3, your local news leader. So here's the exciting news. Besides just bragging rights, the Bement students placing first and second now qualify for a national competition in Minneapolis in May. Now the school is figuring out logistics and raising money.